A prosecutor with the Riverside County District Attorney's Office explaining to the jury how investigators have built their case against John David Yoder. He's accused of being a part of a massive child pornography ring along with three other men and molesting a developmentally disabled boy in his care. Horrible things happened in that small community of Desert Hot Springs during that time period. Young boys between the ages of 10 and 15 were photographed naked. They were told to masturbate for money. They were also involved in sexual activities with all four men. So the evidence is quite clear. David Yoder is not charged with touching any one of the children that was molested by these other people. He was not present for any photograph taken of any of these children. He did not possess any photograph taken by any of these children. The case against John David Yoder has actually moved between three different courthouses. Right now the trial's in Banning, but the preliminary trial was in Indio, and the judge there put a gag order in place so that neither the prosecution nor defense could speak to the media. Now, of course, we have a different judge for the trial, but neither the prosecution or defense was willing to speak with us. The prosecution firm in the belief that they can prove all 12 counts against Yoder, many of which include charges of aiding and abetting the other three conspirators in the porn ring. Working it off essentially meant revealing more of yourself, your body, your genitalia, and or committing or doing sex acts with these men. He was not present when it happened. He didn't take the photograph. He never molested these children. And yet, this is an example of guilt by association.